Yo, what's going on, everybody? Um, basically, there has been a lot going on in the last couple days, and I guess I want to kind of address what's going on. Like, social media is just so crazy that, you know what? I don't even want to explain any of that yet, but um, let me show you guys this clip real fast. Um, it, it went crazy on Instagram, went insane on Twitter, and, you know, I just, let me just show you guys real fast. Well... Looks like we have a problem. I know I said I was going to stream, but yeah. He will be streaming from the floor because that shit broke. All right, so um, after watching that clip, um, I know people are probably going to run it back. But basically, both of my gaming monitors were smashed on top of my entire setup, on top of my PlayStation 4. My keyboard, my mouse, my microphone, my Yeti was like literally like destroyed. My entire gaming table was smashed, right? It was it was darn near cracked in half. And a lot of people on Twitter and, you know, Instagram and stuff like that were like, you know, they were real concerned. And, you know, basically they heard my wife in the background saying that, <laughs> you know, I'm going to run it back one more time, one more time. Well, looks like we have a problem. I know I said I was going to stream, but yeah. He will be streaming from the floor because that shit broke. So if if you heard it, um, before I tried to explain, I was basically making an Instagram story. Um, if you don't follow me on Instagram, you might want to follow me because a lot of crazy stuff goes down on there. But basically... Before I can explain what happened to my setup, my wife screams in the background that I'm going to be streaming from the floor because that shit broke, which means my, since my entire setup fell on top of the table and the table was basically compromised, I didn't even know if I was even going to be able to stream that day. So she made a joke saying that I'm going to be streaming from the floor, which means I'm still going to be streaming. I'm not not going to stream and that by any means necessary, I needed to stream that day. Now, if a lot of you guys don't know, um, I have become a Facebook gaming streamer. Um, if you don't know what that means, basically, it's just like a Twitch streamer or a YouTube streamer. But mainly my focus of streaming is on Facebook. I do streams from, you know, here, here, and here on YouTube, but I don't really stream on Twitch anymore. But mainly I stream on Facebook. Um, that link will be in the description. But basically, um, in order to do my hours for the month, I had to stream that day. There was no not streaming. Like, I literally had to stream. And when I came downstairs, my setup was smashed on top of my, like, everything. So, you know, the first person that I accused was, of course, one of my kids. And then the next person that I accused was my wife, right? So, you know, a lot of people on Twitter and Instagram and stuff like that, like with her making that comment, I guess they didn't know what she meant. And, you know, so they were like, yo, you should leave her like that's messed up that she would do that to you. I can't believe she broke your setup and everything like that. Like everybody was ready to bash my wife and blame my wife and everything like that. But come to find out. It was my fault. Yeah, so basically, if anybody did follow me on Instagram um, that day, basically, I, you know, broke down what happened, you know, like story by story, 10 second by 10 second. Basically, when I came downstairs, everything was smashed up. And, you know, I was looking around, I was trying to find somebody to blame. And then as I start pulling the setup out to then, you know, pull, pick up the monitors, pick up the mount, you know, try to figure out what was damaged, what wasn't, what, you know, um, um, investment did I lose that day? I noticed that the actual clamp for the mount was literally it squeezed the table. Yes, the table that I got from Ikea, it squeezed it so much and it was so heavy that it literally broke the table it smashed the table during there in half and basically it's my fault i'm the reason literally i'm the re i don't know why I hashtag the reason i don't know why i'm always the reason things happen but things always happen around me 
So, you know, I was looking at it and I was like, oh my God. So on my story, I think the story is still on my Instagram as well. So if you want to watch that, you can. But basically the, 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 the Ikea tables, these high gloss, nice looking tables that they always present. A lot of streamers, a lot of YouTubers, a lot of uh, even PC uh, tech reviewers. They all We all have the same type of table from Ikea. It's white gloss. It looks really nice, but it's not durable at all. And I found out the hard way. So what basically happened was it smashed the table. And I looked in between that. And within that happening... I saw that there was no wood inside the table. None at all. Now, my wife made a video response. Basically, it wasn't really a response. It was more so what tends to happen in our home 24-7. So the first thing that she did was pull out the camera when I walked down the steps. That was the first thing she did. She said, hold up. Before you say anything, I got to record this. So what you are about to see is the first reaction. My my reaction to my table being like literally destroyed monitors all over the place. This is the reaction. And this is what she did to me. Let me get my footage. Let me set up fall apart. Because your shit is cheap. Cheap. From Ikea. Look at that. Look at that. Can't even hold it up. Look at you. Better hope these monitors ain't broke. You got $2,000 worth of shit on top of a $50 table. <laughs> You should smack yourself for that. <laughs> you really should. This table was not fifty fucking dollars. First of all, a hundred and nine, maybe. One hundred and eighty-eight. It wasn't one hundred and eighty-eight. Look up the price. The the top was fifty. The legs was ten. You got four legs. That's forty dollars. Get the fuck Be out of here. Get the Be real. Get the fuck out my office. No. <laughs> yeah, shit is cheap. Cheap. Shopping from IKEA. What? <laughs> What's your favorite story? When you go to Ikea and you swear your shit is the shit. I was telling you before that shit is cheap. Cheap. Cheap, 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 cheap. But no, you ain't want to believe your wife. I told you before that shit was cheap. Cheap, 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 cheap. Oh, you mad? Oh no. See, cause I shop at Raymore. You see my shit falling apart? Now, <laughs> with that video, I, ooh, I wanted to, <laughs> she plays all day. This is what we do all day. So, you know, from here on out, man, my wife has decided that when things happen in our home, she'll pull out the camera, she'll record it. And I if I if I if I deem it fit, we'll start making videos in the house. But I'm telling you right now, she play way too much. You hear me? Way too much. This is your boy IKC signing out. Make sure you guys subscribe if you're not already. Turn on notifications. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. All right, guys, this is the end of the video. I hope you guys definitely enjoy this video. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and you can also watch one of my previous videos after hitting that subscribe button. I hope you guys like this video. Let's get this thing to 5,000 likes. And this is your boy IKC signing out. Peace.